told by Lindy Ruff, their truck team having trouble scoring. He's one of those players that they're waiting yeah. for. Yeah, he's missed a lot of time and injury in his young career, hasn't he, Joe? Yes, he has. Dylan Cousins with a rocket of a shot beats Shesterkin. And the Sabres take a 2-0 lead. Did a good job against Ottawa in their last game. But hit by Trocek after the release on Dennis Gilbert. They're winning a lot of battles, too. Run in by Paterka. Shot by Cage Thompson. And he scores to make it 3 to nothing. Opportunity to keep it in in the far corner. And Buffalo speed, it's been evident. They're getting out quickly and they're coming up with speed when given the chance. But it's discipline in their own end and they're winning battles. Sabres went over eight minutes without a shot on goal. And Tage Thompson rips one past Shesterkin. And the Sabres now with a 3 0 lead. There's that shot. I mean, he's got nine goals oh, on the man. season now, Thompson. All of those at even strength. Dylan Cousins and Tage Thompson scoring here, driving to the net. They score again! Greenway off a beautiful feed from Jason Zucker. What a move by Zucker to the front. Greenway was wide open. It's 4 yeah, nothing Buffalo. I, I believe it was Ryan Lingren that just lost the puck. And it, it looked like the Rangers were not in trouble. And then all of a sudden there's a turnover. And Zucker does a lot of the work. So there's the play behind right there. Just a quick turn by Lindgren, but he loses the puck. And Zucker is able to scoop it up and just turn and take it hard to the net on a beautiful pass. He shot out of a cannon coming out of that. And I think the whole building thought Zucker was going to shoot that puck right in front of the net. Corner, Jacob Bryson, number oh, 78, oh, with it. Smith on him. Sabres move up. Shot by Benson, saved by Shesterkin. Now it's Hedl, able to clear it out. Sabres with three goals here in the second. Keandre Miller moves in. Miller goes around the net, played it back for Hedl, but Mallenstein with a good play. Hedl winds it deep, chases after it was Kako who sent in the pass. Hedl try to play it. Lafferty, number 81, able to move it up. Buffalo is Lafferty's fifth team in the NHL. Allen Stein with Lafferty. He scores! Oh, my! This game has gotten out of hand. The Sabres, with three quick goals, four in the period, now have a 5 nothing lead. Yeah, and Lafferty really made a nice play at the blue line. And to find a little space, he'll make a quick move. Now, speaking of quick, there's quick is going to get the call. Is still going for the Rangers, but it was it was good work. Here's here's the passing and the speed again. Here they come. There's Malenstein with a real good play at the blue line, and then Lafferty able to control it and just tips it over. Yeah, not the easiest pass to handle. Lafferty does a great job just keeping it alive and getting something on the net. Malenstein coming through the neutral zone, whether he knew or not, the recognition to attack the forward. It was Edstrom covering for Miller, who went down to try and create something. And he almost had a play with his stick on the puck. It just got underneath him through his triangle. Malenstein went right by him for the two on one. Now the Rangers starting to change up their lines. You've got Kreider with Trocek and Lafreniere. Okay. Kreider had been with Hedl. Kreider thought that was an offside when Lafferty played it ahead. He thought he drew it out of the zone and then sent it in. But no call by either linesman. I didn't, I didn't think it was, Sam. I might okay. be wrong, but I, I thought it was fine. Chevrolet time on ice. Rangers pinned in their zone for a little while here. Dahlin carrying it deep. Around the boards. And that shot, score! J.J. Paterka does it again against the Rangers. He's played seven games against the Rangers. This is his fifth goal against them. 
Oh, what a shot. And five goals in this period. Boy, over the blue line. Here's the call. At 3.30 of the second period, the play was offside. We have no goal. Well, a break for the Rangers. Good call, Chris Kreider. Yes. He was on it. Oh, I mean, they're not. Again, they're, they're moving. And you give them credit for the way they're playing, but they're not. Not facing much physically. Ooh, Cousins with a quick turnaround shot to save by Quick. Didn't know where it was, was in his body. After the whistle, Zucker and Tuba faced off, and they were separated. Buffalo's third power play of the game, they're 0 for 2. Zucker has to go get a new stick. As he and Truba had come together on the side of the net.